On Tuesday, the 14th of August 2024, Microsoft Windows pushed an update for their Windows 10 and 11. You might be wondering what's new in it, as we frequently see with Windows updates, but there was something fishy in this update, because in this update Microsoft secretly patched a high-severity vulnerability. Microsoft has confirmed a critical vulnerability in its TCP IP protocol that could allow remote attackers to execute code on all Windows systems using IPv6. The vulnerability, identified as CVE 2024-38063, is particularly concerning as IPv6 is enabled by default on most Windows installations. The flaw, discovered by Kunlun Labs' Zhao Wei, stems from an integer underflow weakness. Attackers could exploit this to trigger buffer overflows, paving the way for arbitrary code execution. Zhao Wei has refrained from disclosing more details for now, as to complicate malicious actors taking advantage of it. To conduct this attack, threat actors can repeatedly send IPv6 packets that include specially crafted packets. By doing this, an unauthenticated attacker could exploit this vulnerability, leading to remote code execution. Systems that have IPv6 disabled are not susceptible to this vulnerability. Microsoft has classified this vulnerability as exploitation more likely, indicating a high probability of threat actors developing exploit code. For the time I am uploading this video, there is no proof of concept available for this vulnerability. It's not clear if this is being exploited in the wild right now and how widespread it is, but ideally, the problem should be patched before people actually get hurt. While disabling IPv6 can mitigate the risk, Microsoft advises against it. IPv6 is a core component of modern Windows versions, and disabling it could impact system functionality. Dustin Childs, Head of Threat Awareness at Trend Micro's Zero Day Initiative, also labelled it as wormable, meaning it could spread between vulnerable systems without user interaction, which is also called zero-click vulnerability. Although this isn't the first IPv6-related vulnerability in Windows, its ease of exploitation makes it particularly dangerous. What makes a vulnerability dangerous is not only how much it can actually wreak havoc, but also how easy it is for someone to gain access to it. If you haven't updated your computer in a while, you'll want to do so as soon as you get the chance before something catastrophic happens. Make sure your computer is fully updated with all the latest security patches. All right, everyone, that's all I have for you today. Please have a subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you found this video informative. Thank you for watching.